Hi guys and welcome to Cooking for the Women, the site for men who love to cook delicious meals for their ladies. I'm Chef Jorge. And I'm Chef Donato. And Chef Donato and I just got back from the heart of Little Havana in Miami, Florida. And what a great place that is. And what a great place for amazing food. That's right. And today we're bringing you a recipe that's going to make your lady smile from ear to ear. Camarones, enchilados, a la cubana. Are you from Cuba? Uh, some people say that. It sounds like you are. Yeah, <laughs> I, can't, I can't hide. Yeah, I know you can, but if my dictionary app serves me correctly, I believe what you just described is Cuban style shrimp creole. That's right. And that's what they call it in Cayo Ah. Yeah. Shall we let the guys in on what's involved? Si, senor. Como no? Ah. Here we Here go! go. One pound of large shrimp cleaned and peeled. A quarter cup of extra virgin olive oil. Two garlic cloves chopped. Half a medium onion finely chopped. A half of a green pepper. It's got to be seedless and you're going to chop it. And a quarter cup of parsley. You're going to get a half a can of 20 ounce crushed tomatoes. And a half small jar of pimentos with juice. Okay. I've and I have the juice. Got to have the juice in there. Okay. We're going to get then a quarter cup of ketchup. Or ketchup. Ketchup. Or whatever, you know. Ketchup. Ketchup. A quarter cup of your favorite Merlot, and by the way, you can have a little Merlot on the side. See. Si. Yeah. See. Si. One teaspoon of red wine vinegar. One bay leaf. Three quarter teaspoon of salt. Three quarter teaspoon of black pepper. A half a teaspoon of Worcestershire, Worcestershire sauce. <laughs> and uh, half a teaspoon of Tabasco sauce. And one tablespoon of chopped green olives. And this last ingredient is very important, guys, and I'm going to have Chef Donato say it. One good pinch of cumin. Not Cuban, cumin. Fabuloso! As you know, we scour the earth and we try to find dishes that are simple to make. Better believe it, guys. We like to make things easier for you. That's why we use shrimp that are already split, cleaned, and all you have to do is get them ready for cooking. Hi fellas, welcome to Wine Corner. You know, Cuban cuisine was highly influenced by dishes from Spain. So we thought, what better wine to pair with our shrimp dish than with a nice Spanish Rioja wine. And this particular wine comes from a region of Northern Spain and has the characteristics of black cherry, licorice, and tobacco leaf. It's a medium bodied and elegant wine with a sweet oak tannin. Oh, that's smooth. This is going to go excellent with our Cuban shrimp creole dish. Enjoy. All right, let's get back to cooking. Right now, we're going to be chopping the onion, the garlic, and the green pepper. And don't forget to take those seeds out. So, uh, watch this. We've cut this onion in half. We're leaving the root in and we're gonna be starting to chop this away. Don't chop all the way through, okay? Because that leaves the onion together. See, it's all one piece. And then you can slice the other way. And now for the garlic. Again, we're chopping it. We want to chop it nice and small. Now we only need half of a green pepper. So we want to get this middle part out that has all the seeds, okay? Out. Voila. Okay, fellas. In a large skillet, we're going to be heating a quarter cup of olive oil over medium heat. When hot, and you'll see a little bit of smoke coming up, we're now going to be adding our vegetables. We're adding the garlic.
we're gonna bring the heat down to a simmer. And there's no need to cover it. Boy, that smells good, Chef Donato. Remember, this is still cooking for maybe about two minutes, and then you start adding the rest of the ingredients, like the salt, pepper, and we're going to use only half of this can of crushed tomatoes, okay? You can save the rest for another occasion. Continue cooking at the simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, so while our Creole sauce is simmering, we're gonna make some white rice. We're gonna take one cup of white rice. We use Tio Ben. You could use whatever white rice you like. But get a good quality, boys, okay? One cup. We need one and a half cups of water. We need a half a teaspoon of salt. We need one crushed garlic clove. And we need one tablespoon of olive oil. Let's get started. Okay, let's put the water in. Next will come a half of a teaspoon of salt. Let's get that garlic clove in. Last but not least, one tablespoon of olive oil. We're gonna bring this to boil. We'll need to add the rice to the water once the water is boiling. The water is boiling, so we're going to add the rice. After you put the rice in, we're gonna bring the water to a second boil. We're then going to turn it down to simmer. We're going to cover it and cook it for 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, fellas. So the rice is almost done and we're ready for the shrimp. We're going to add the shrimp to the sauce and cook them for about four to five minutes or until the shrimp look nice and pink. Well, it's been like five minutes and the shrimp are ready. So we're gonna serve. Mmm, delicious. And paired with that vino Rioja, it's perfect. Our women are gonna love it. Mm. Wow, it is delicious. Hey, Chef Donato, what do you say we have a toast? Hey, Chef. Salud. Salud. Hey guys, don't forget to like us on Facebook and catch the rest of our recipes on YouTube.